Today I'm going to show you one TV box. It's very popular these days. I just bought it from internet. So let's unbox it. TV box. Power supply. HDMI cable. Remote control. And manual. From the looks, box seems very good, strong build, and very small. Before using the TV box, I will advise you to use this mini keyboard, this wireless keyboard. It's very easy to operate your TV box, because when you are surfing on internet, you require something to type, so it's easy to type from the keyboard. Is a wireless jungle. And you can put this jungle on any USB port of your TV box. So now I'm going to show how to connect the TV box. This HDMI cable. Put this HDMI cable to your TV box HDMI port. And this uh, internet cable put inside the Ethernet port and this power supply. Now we are going to power on our TV box. Let's go. Now it's booting. It will take some time to boot. So here's our box logo. So the box is already put it. You see it's very good box and everything is very smooth. Settings, local, my app. In this you can find there's something pre reinstall. So now we do settings first. Like if you want to connect your Wi-Fi, go to the settings and select network and choose your Wi-Fi. So our Wi-Fi is this, so I choose this and put the password. See, I'm right now I'm using the remote control. So I feel difficult to input the characters or text through remote control. So that's why I advise you to use the, this keyboard. So I will show you how this keyboard works. This keyboard is really fantastic with RGB colors, giving good lookout. So till our connection is connecting Wi-Fi. So now our Wi-Fi is connected. So let's go for the different settings. To download any AP, you need to go to your Google Store. Here is a Google Play Store. Maybe our internet is a little bit slow, so it's taking some time. So here you need to put your Google ID. If you have ID, you can put your current ID. If you don't have, you can create your new ID from this option. As I already have the ID, so I'm going to use my ID.
this is my Google ID and I put it, then I put next and it will ask for the password. So here you need to put your password. Next. So you need to accept the terms and condition of Google Play Store. So press next. It's asking for the payment information if you like to download some paid APPs. As we are not going to download some paid APPs, so I will click this remind me later. And press next. So now your Google account is ready. You can download APPs. So right now I'm going to show you some good APPs. These APPs are free. You can download and watch movies. First APP is Chubby. We select this and then install. Because we are using the first time, so we need to accept all the terms and conditions. Now app is downloaded, so we go, we are going to open. So, because the box is new, so we need to update Google Play services. So we press update. It will take some time, and click this. Once again, accept all the terms and conditions. So till that it's downloading. Now Google Play services are already downloaded. Now it's installing. Now it's already installed. So let's move to APP, which we just installed. This APP is really fantastic. You can see latest movies on it. Let's find this movie. <coughs> it will take some time. It depends on the internet speed and the movie server. So you need to be, be a little bit because you are watching free movies. So, movie is working. So, now I'm going to tell you one more uh, site from where you can see some more APPs to download and watch movies, TV shows. So now we are going to browse one website. From there we can see a lot of information about APPs. So we need to go and open Google Chrome and type deals promo oh it's automatic account so 
So let's go there. Now we go to their blog section. So here is a lot of APPs there mentioning here is like Kotu Movies, Chubi, we already downloaded, Sony, Crackle, TV, so many. So you can note down this blog and from there you can download many APPs. So I'm going to show one app from here. So it's open and here they mention about how to download, how to use it and what settings you need to change for it. To download we need to click here. And we need to update this permission because we are using first time. Allow. It's taking some time because our internet is a little bit slow. So now movie is already downloaded. So we close this. and go to my app and find downloads so here is the downloaded file we are going to install now it's installing Well, now we can open or uh, press done whatever you like so whenever you install any APPs you need to give permissions to access your box so this is also one of uh, good APP for watching movies most of all new movies are on it so let's try this in this APB there is one more good thing that you can download the movie and watch later. And when you press play it will be give you the option for the quality quality of movies. You can choose from it. So here is the list of quality of movie. So we can choose anyone like it's 720p. We can choose this video quality. And after clicking it's downloading. Now movie is start. Picture quality is very good because that's it's in 720p so here's the movie start this is really very good free app to watch movies so now i'm going to tell you how to install app from usb drive my usb drive i have already downloaded some apps so let's going to connect it so put this usb drive in any usb port browse and go to your file manager
Fire browser, you can use it and select your USB drive. See, here is a lot of list of some APPs and files. So, I'm going to show you some. Let's try this APP. Just need to select and Press install like that uh, I told you in last app. This app is good for some TV channels and movies from different different countries. It's already installed. Now I'm going to open it. Select agree. Again, it will allow permission. So this app is ready. You can see that there's a lot of TV channels, news, shows, movies, sports, music, gaming, animal, and so on. So let's try some TV channels like HBO. Oh, problem. Don't worry, it's sometimes it's happened due to the server, network server. Let's try other. Here is the list of channels. So let's try this channel, HPO. It's working now. In this way, you can watch live channels from this app. There's a lot of huge channels inside it. You can watch movies, TVs. You can select from it. Our network is a little bit slow, so it will take some time. I want to remind you one point. Please be sure about your network. Movie speed or picture quality depends on your network. So here is a cartoon channel is working. Sorry, my network is a little bit slow. You can try at your home with your TV box. It should work. Thanks for watching.